Hey everyone, my name is Joshua Wikes and I'm a, an adventure and landscape photographer. And my wife Lavinia and our dog Tilly are living full time in our converted sprinter van, traveling all over the US and Canada in search of adventure and the beauty of God's creation. We love that you're watching these videos and if you like our videos that we're putting out, hit that subscribe button. If you like this video in particular, give us a like. And if you have any questions about me, about our van, about Tilly, leave a comment and I'll be sure to get back to you. This video is all about Mount Rainier National Park. You know, this is a park that I've been longing to get to for years. So I am super excited that I get to go check it out and see it up close. Similar to our last episode in the North Cascades, which by the way, if you haven't watched that video yet, go check it out. Our timing is not ideal. If you're in search of wildflowers and maybe want a little less snow on your hikes, July would probably be your better bet versus May, which is what we're doing. So let's go check it out. There's some really beautiful waterfalls at Mount Rainier, which we really enjoyed. Some of them we had to hike to, including this one to Myrtle Falls, which was through the snow. What will probably be my most memorable part of our time at Mount Rainier is the hike I did to Panorama Point. On a normal day that doesn't include almost 10 feet of snow on the ground, this is a 5.6 mile hike with over 1,700 feet of elevation gain. Looking good, guys. I knew this wasn't gonna be an easy hike with the snow, but little did I know how challenging it was gonna get. While most of the hikers worked their way further up to the summit, after stopping at Panorama Point, I continued on the Skyline Loop Trail to start heading back down the mountain. I wasn't alone as there were five other hikers looking to head the same way. The challenge was we were doing this hike relatively early in the day and any tracks from previous hikers from the day before had melted away. 
So although we knew from GPS where the trail was meant to be, we couldn't see it and I ended up leading us back down the mountain. At times this was not easy and at times it was very scary. We all made it safely down the mountain and this will definitely be something I will remember for a very long time. The word that comes to mind when I think of Mount Rainier is simply awesome majesty. Okay, that is two words. But it was an incredible location and we just continue to feel very blessed that we're able to see these amazing parts of God's creation. Well, our time in the Pacific Northwest is coming to an end. You know, we've had such a great time up here. We've been here for just about a month and we really hope that you've enjoyed watching these episodes of this series. You know, we've got one more stop to make before we start heading up into Canada to go to Banff and Jasper. Stay tuned next week for that episode and then follow us as we head into Canada and then up to Alaska and beyond for the summer. I'm gonna leave you with just two more photos here at the end, but that's it for now. We'll see you on the road next time and may God bless you.